I've wanted to cut my hair for a long time, so let's just do it. Let's cut all of it off. You know, when it's straightened, it looks quite nice. Such a beautiful long hair. I see some lines in it, but still, your face is good with a bob line. That will be very good, but the right bob line, the right length. Okay, I'm ready. I think whatever, it's just three years of hair growth. <laughs> okay. Like I said, the ponytail technique. For once and for all, if you are pulling your hair, like if you are having hair that is combed through here and hair that is combed through here. If you are taking this piece together, then you will have two pieces on the side that is taking a longer distance than the pieces in the middle. So you will have a concave. So you cut it straight and then this will fall down and you have a curved line or a triangle because you are taking the two sections to each other. Normally they take it in here and then you have a V-shape in the back. She's taking the ponytails way in the back so it will be better that it will be longer in the front but still it's all the hair is taken into one point. It's never a good idea if you want to cut a, a bob line or something longer you will have to comb your hair straight and it's better to ask somebody to do that but you take a section, you comb it, you cut a straight line and you take a fine section, very thin section, you comb it on top of that and you have to wet your hair, otherwise you can not see the line of the previous cutted section. So when you see the line is coming through, then you know your section is thin enough and you follow that line and then you have a straight line. If you cut the first line, you will check the both sides after cutting one section, you check the level if it's symmetrical and then you follow that line. Always try to cut the front a little bit longer because if you are drying it, it will jump up. Otherwise, if you cut it in the same length and you are brushing it or drying it, it will jump up and then the front is shorter, less beautiful. And you are not cutting straight. You are cutting it like that. So you're cutting it with the blades on this side and not flat. You are not cutting on the same length. You will have a small disconnection on the back. You will have like a band of different layers because you are cutting it like that and not like that. <laughs> Good scissors, by the way. It's not kitchen scissors. Oh my god. <laughs> what have I done? There's no turning back now. Imagine that you stop now, then you have an asymmetrical uh, hairstyle. Something different. Who cares? Who cares? Rolls back again. There's a ponytail pinned to the back. For the front, I guess. Oh, how you cut it now? Oh my! Th oh no, look, look at, at the line that she's cutting. This is really strange. This hurt. Oh, this hurts. The way he does it. <sighs> no way this will be straight no God, way uh, so much. you will have a band that it's very uneven so it will not be all in the same length let's just take it out exciting the reveal let's <laughs> probably see. won't be straight at all <laughs> it will not be straight but hey You cut it that short. Look, you see already <laughs> the uneven line. Ouch. Holy 
shit. It's more symmetrical than I expected, but you see the band, you see the uneven line that is cut it because you, you, you cut it like that and like that and never straight. Oh shit. <laughs> Well, for people that has a really pixie hair, this is not short. This is so half length. The length that you came from, yes, this is short. Okay, it's not, I guess, uh, <laughs> it's definitely not straight. Wow, it's so weird. I haven't had this short hair. You can only have a very clean, beautiful line if you comb it section by section on top of each other and cut it straight. If you put it in a ponytail, it's never, never straight. Never. Oh my God, yeah. That's cute. Isn't it always like that? People put their hair up and then, oh, now I like it. This is what it looks like after I just like cut it. Why do you like it if it's in a ponytail? Because you are used to that look. If you have long hair, you do it in a ponytail, you have the same look. You have to get used to the length and it will take, it will, be strange for a few days. It's not bad. The length is not bad. A little bit shorter will be better because you have a long shaped face. And if you cut it underneath the chin, then you make your face longer. So a little bit shorter would be better, but please don't do it yourself. Oh, I don't know what it looks like in the back. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> Probably not straight. Might be a friend. Okay, so it's a while later that the light has now changed. She cut it a little bit shorter and you see that the, the, the length is way better for her face already. I tried to fix it a little bit, but um, I think we can quickly agree that it's in no way straight in the back. You can kind of see it dipping there. Just oh. Absolute chaos in the back. Oh, that's looking bad if it was a little bit longer i would say put some curls in it and you don't see it but with this bob line it has to be straight fortunately i just do not have enough time right now because i need to go to work and i've got hair absolutely everywhere so i need to <laughs> get ready to go but this is the best i could do for now um <laughs> which is not great at all um i'm gonna have to come back in the evening and just thin it out as well because i've got so much hair it's so thick in the back which just makes it look even more like a huge block of just hair i'm just gonna have to come back and fix it later and you're going to do that by yourself thinning that's dangerous all right so i'm trying to fix it a little bit um i think like it's a lot more straight now but not at all perfect my hair is so thick that it's really difficult to thin it out at least by myself i'm not hairdresser <laughs> okay let's just look at the back Pretty hard to cut back up by yourself you see in the back it's still not straight you have still a band of uneven layers what i suggest is for me if it's really flat and straight it's not so beautiful than you had before so maybe a little bit of curtain bangs so it's it's to the back would be better for the shape of your face now it's really sharp your face but the length is better for your face but i would do it a little bit looser in the front so it's a little bit maybe with, with some curtain bangs uh that would be better feels so futuristic right now because it's so straight i'm not feeling like a robot i'm just gonna style a little bit so it looks a little more natural um like this so this is the final result well, that's it. You saw me cut my hair, so see you. So you see when she's doing it a little bit backwards, not flat backwards, but a little bit looser, it's better for the shape of her face. So maybe a little bit of length until underneath the nose 
a little bit of, of layers and then do it backwards. So it's a little bit looser than the straight style. Why am I gonna do this? Why am I, why am I doing this? Equally long hair, but you see that this hair has a history. It's more damaged. It may be a better idea to cut these lengths because they have suffered. Hi, I decided that I'm going to cut my hair today. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I mean, it's almost 2020. New changes, right? Am I right? We could always have a new look. <laughs> this is so scary. Okay, I thought I was gonna be able to do this. Okay, so my hair is parted. All right, it's wet. Okay, 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 ok
you should have left it. Waited a few days, get used to it, but now not like you cut it two centimeters shorter, you cut it a big piece shorter. So it was not step by step, you did it, you was overwhelmed with excitement and you go over the top. Dang it! Dang it. Oh my gosh, I should have left it. No, I look so stupid! No, 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 okay, I could fix this, I could fix this. <laughs> Look at the back, long short. piece. No, no, we don't see the long piece. We don't see the long piece. But I bet, I'm sure it's the long piece in the back. Press one of these videos to see more hair fails and hair tips. Have you learned from this video? Have you been entertained by this video? Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Press that notification bell. You can follow me on Instagram. You can follow me on Facebook. You can follow me on TikTok. All I'm going to say today is, ciao kiss.